For the past 27 years, a Montreal association has been providing much needed resources for disabled immigrants. On March 29th, there will be a benefit concert at Place des Arts to make sure the group can continue helping some 500 people. Here's Deborah Arbeck. Integrating into Quebec society is difficult enough, but imagine what it's like for immigrants with disabilities. It's like you feel that the, the land is shaking, you know. You are not sure for, for the next step, what you must do. Luciana Suave knows that feeling. When she immigrated from Italy with her disabled son, she was virtually lost. It was pretty hard to try to find the specialized resources and to know where to go, what to do. To spare other immigrants that step, she founded the Multi-Ethnic Association for the Integration of Persons with Disabilities. The Resource Center provides access to French and English language classes, adapted transportation, even social activities. This intellectually disabled group is learning basic French while they paint. Today, a special surprise. Pop opera singer Georgia Fumanti has stopped in to sing. The Italian native now calls Montreal home. Fumanti might be an international star, but even she felt alone when she first moved here. And she's seen the prejudice people with disabilities face. And I had a special uncle when I was a child that um, he had some problem, mental problem, and I saw him suffering. He was crying in front of me and he was asking me why I can't live a normal life. <laughs> So she's here to help people like Setiana. The Romanian was severely burned as a child and doesn't want other handicapped people to suffer the anguish she did back home. Because just because they are seeing me with all fingers, they are thinking that I don't have mind. The center guided Setiana to French lessons. She plans to work as a teacher for the disabled one day. They are here to help, to try to help everybody. And um, I think it's very important. So important, Fumanti is performing a benefit concert for the center at Place des Arts, March 29th. A celebration, she says, of the diversity the center represents. Deborah Arbeck, CTV News.